Hello viewers, welcome to Destined to Win Tutorials and Projects. Uh, you're welcome once again. This is part 3 where we'll treat YEC past questions. Now, this is a question from YEC 2003 and OBJ question 1. And it says simplify this fraction. Remember, we put down our rule, board mass. And so from here, we'll start with R bracket so let's solve what's in the bracket we have 3 over 4 minus 1 over 3 what this is what's the LCM of 4 and 3 is 12 12 in 4 is 3 times 3 9 minus 12 in uh, 3 in 12 that's 4 times 1 it's 4 and 9 minus 4 is 5 so here we have 5 over 12 from the brackets so from this we finally have 5 over 12 multiply let's change this miss fractions to proper fractions so we have 4 times 3 plus 1 4 times 3 12 plus 1 13 over 3 4 times 3 12 plus 1 also we have 13 over 4 so from here, the next operation we'll perform is division. So we have 5 over 12 multiplied by 13 over 3 times 4. To change the division to multiplication, we have to invert these two numbers. So this is it. So from here, multiplication all through. So we can just cancel out. 13 would cancel this itself. What else can be canceled? 4 here, 1. And 4 will go in into uh, uh, 12 3 times and we're left with what? 5, 3 times 3, 9. So our answer is 5 over 9. And this is our correct option. 5 over 9. Let's see another question here. It's a question from YF 2015. A theory question, part 1. You notice that in every YEC, part one is the compulsory uh, part for uh, the theory questions. It's compulsory. So, and I've noticed, and if you also notice from your past question, you always have a fraction to solve in part one, which is compulsory. So we must make sure we get that mark. And it's always good you show your solutions well, because this is not an OBJ question, it's theory. So from here, we state that we're going to use board mass. Let's change everything here to proper fraction. So we have three times nine times three, 27 plus four. That is 31 over nine divided by, let's change this in the bracket to proper fractions. We have 15, three times this is 15 plus one, 16 over three minus four times two, eight plus three, 11 over four plus 10 times 5 50 plus 9 we have 59 over 10. what operation do we perform first we perform uh, operations in the bracket so we have this uh, let's just solve this here the lcm is 12 12 3 and 12 that's 4 4 times 16 that would give us uh, 64 minus 4, that's 12 times uh, 4 in 12, that's 3, uh, that's 3 times 11, 33. If we subtract this, what do we get? We get 1 and 3, that's 31 over 12 plus 59 over 10. From here, what's the next operation for us to perform? We are going to perform the division, right? So we have 31 over 9 multiplied by 12 over 31. Isn't that it? So from here, let's perform this. So we have here 31 here, 1. And 3 will go here how many times? 3 times. And to go here how many times? 4 times. So we're left with 4 over 3 plus 59 over 10. 
from here we perform addition so here what's the lcm with uh, three and nine what's the lcm so what's the lcm with three and ten is what 30 30 here 10 3 in 30 10 multiply by 4 we have what 40 plus uh, 10 in 33 multiply by uh, 59 we have 177 so this is if we add this two we should get uh, this would be a 7 uh, that would be an 11 1 carry 1 that's 2 so we have this it's always proper in your theory questions that you convert this to a mixed fraction so we can check how many times will 30 go into 217 it could go like uh let's say let's say about uh, seven times Another question we have here is from 2015 OBJ question 10 and it says if M is 4, N is 9 and R is 16, evaluate M over 9 minus this plus this. So let's just put in the value into our operation. So we have what's M? Remember to write board mass. M is 4 n is 9 minus let's change this to a proper fraction that's 9 times 1 9 plus 17 we have 16 over 9 plus 9 over what's our 16 so let's perform addition first so this carries the addition so we'll perform addition on these two fraction so we have 4 over 9 plus 9 over 16 the LCM of 9 and 16 is 144. Now, this 16, uh, 9 in 144, 16 times, times 4, we have 64. Plus 9, 16 in 144, it's 9, 9. 9 times 9, it's 1. When we add this, what do we get? We have 5, that's 4 plus 1. And 6 plus 8 is 14. So we have 145 over 144. So let's now perform subtraction, which is our next operation. So we can do this here. So we have 145 over 144 minus 16 over 9. So what's the LCM here? Still 144. 144 in 144 is 1 times 145 we have this uh minus 144 uh, 9 in 144 is 16 16 times 16 we have 256 so this is going to carry a negative sign let's uh, subtract this if we subtract what do we get let's just solve this here we have 1 uh, 5 minus this we have 1 and 1. So we have what? Minus 1, 1 over 144. Can we break this down further? Let's check if we can break this down further. Yes, we can break this down further. 3 can go in here, right? 3 in 11, let's say 9. 3 remainder 2 in 21 is 7. And 3 in 14, we would have like 4 times, that's in 12, remainder 2. And uh, 3 in 24 is how many times? 8 times. So we have finally minus 37 over 48. And this is our correct answer. Thank you for staying tuned to Destined to Win Tutorials and Projects.